Well, Metro police are searching for a suspect after they say he stole a car, led them on a high-speed chase, and then crashed into an apartment building on the east side. Investigators tell us he took off after that and is still on the run this morning. We've got Anna Carrera live at Metro Police Headquarters downtown to tell us more. Anna? And police tell us this all started with a report of shots fired on the east side near 30th and Midhoffer, and then the chase started. And take a look at what happened when they caught up to that car. Police tell us the person driving this blue Toyota Corolla was involved in an armed carjacking on Saturday. They believe they say when they found this person, they believe who took it, he sped away, sometimes going upwards of 70 miles per hour across the east side. The driver eventually lost control, crashing into a building at the Brookview Apartments, where there were people inside. One witness told us the crash was so loud, she thought a bomb was going off. Yeah, I was, I was on the ground crying. I was, we went in the kitchen and sat on the floor and, you know, was trying to call somebody and figure out what was going on and letting them know we heard something. And then when we came outside, we seen the police, so we figured, like, something bad done happened, but we didn't know a whole car was inside of the building. Yeah, five people were inside that home when the car crashed into it. That includes a boy who was actually sleeping in the bedroom where that car made impact. He is expected to be okay, and police say they are still looking for the person who crashed that car. You'll hear more about that, plus hear from that boy's family coming up in the next half hour. Mm -hmm. All right, Anna, thank you. Well, hundreds of